Hey there guys and gals of YouTube world. Just gonna make a short video here. We'll see how short it is, but remember, like my videos, subscribe, and uh, click, click the bell for notification, and be sure to share the ones you like. Uh, this video is just about me meeting one of my goals. I had a goal of meeting uh, Maskey's trifecta, as I'll call it. Yep, I met my goal of completing my trifecta. Now, before explaining exactly what it is, I'll say this. Each segment of it is no big deal. If any of you could probably do better than me in any of the three things I did, you could probably do better at that one, you could probably do better at this one, or do better at that one. But for me, I just did all three, <laughs> okay? So what is Maskey's trifecta that he did? And you need the right elements to do it. You can't, everybody just can't do it where they live at. I happen to live in a place where I can do this. How do I live in a place I can do this? Number one, it's warm year round. Number two, I'm in a residential area and there's lights and stuff. Uh, number three, I have a swimming pool. Number four, I live on the water. So what is Maskey's trifecta? Here's what it is. Earlier today, not that long, just a couple hours ago, late this afternoon, I took my kayak out. It is a tandem kayak, but one person can take it out. So it's the first time I took it out by myself which is a different feeling sitting in it. Cause I sat first in the front seat, but then I realized that's not a good place. I can't control it as well. Can't steer it as easy. So then I moved to the back seat that I normally sat in and then I can steer it better, but I'm also sitting back like the front of the kayaks up just a bit cause all the weights in the back. So what I may do in the future, if I go out alone is move my seat, I, it's, I can move it. So I may move it like up a couple D rings, not towards, not the front, like the back seat, I'll move up, like kind of like one notch forward. Okay, so then I think it'd be closer to the middle, but just behind the middle. So it'd be balanced better and should be fairly easy to steer and paddle and that sort of thing. So, yeah. in case you're wondering, I'm drinking kombucha tonight. Uh, peach kombucha, green wise. That's a local brand in a local public supermarket. So anyway, I did go out kayaking. I did go far. I'll probably check on Google Math, Maps to see how, Google Earth to see how far I went. Basically I went down my canal, passed another canal and kept on going straight. And ended up getting in a conversation with the gentleman down there. And then um, after we finished our conversation, I came on back. When I came back, the business was cooking dinner. Um, but then prior to eating dinner, I went out to my swimming pool and I did my normal routine, which, it, Again, going back to the kayaking, I did not do anything elaborate. I did not travel over to the lake. I did not go out towards the river. I just went all together down and back. I don't know if it's a mile. Maybe it's a mile, maybe not. Maybe it's less than a mile. Okay, so anyway, then in my pool, I didn't do a lot. I do my normal routine, which is swim down and back a couple different times. I'm not a great swimmer, it gets me out of breath. I hold on to the side of the pool, stretch out, and I do leg kicks. You know, the more I do it, the longer I can do it for, just to help work my legs out. Um, then I swim around the pool, kind of like that. <laughs> I don't, uh, not breaststroke, but kind of like a breaststroke. Just one lap around the circumference of the pool. And my pool is 30 feet long, 12 feet wide. Um, and then I kind of go in the deep end, not the deepest part, it's not that deep. And I do some jumping jacks, I do some just stuff my arms up and down. I do leg lifts, leg kicks. And then I'll run in place or I'll run around the pool sometime with exaggerated arm movements and lifting the legs to get my knees elevated just because you got the water as a resistance. Just trying to do a workout. And it takes me 12 to 15 minutes with what I do. And I, play, I may play a little bit in there. I do a little somersaults, like not somersaults, but I twist myself around in the deep end, just kind of flip, I don't know what you call it, I just do it. Uh, just kind of playing a little bit. <clears throat> then what I do today, and I practice backstroke today. Cause I watched a show the other day where the lady was back doing backstroke in the lake and it's like, man, according in that flick, she can backstroke so easily. And I'm not a natural swimmer, so it's not quite as easy for me when I do it. So then after that I completed my pool exercise, um, took a shower, rinsed off, changed, and then dinner was ready. So we had dinner and it was cube steak, 
season with various spices, including onions, red pepper, and garlic. And as we pronounce it here, juca. You may pronounce it yucca or yucca, Y-U-C-C-A. If you see it in a supermarket, it looks like a brown root. Um, but you can cut out the white flesh on the inside. You can boil it. You can fry it. You can bake it. And my, the missus just boiled it tonight. So boil, boiled juca, as it was called in Panama, juca. Kind of like a J, J for the Y. Okay. So after relaxed 10, 15 minutes after dinner, let the food settle just a bit. Um, darkness had settled upon the land. And then we decided to go out for a walk. And we walked. What did we walk? I think when I left the house, I had pushing 6,000 steps. And right now I got 10,747 steps. So I think that's roughly four. That might be four miles. Three to four miles that I walked. <clears throat> just around the neighborhood. It's kind of a cool walk. It was dark. So, but it's cool looking at all the houses. So that was Maskey's trifecta. Kayak, swim, walk. It's not a triathlon. It's not the Ironman in Hawaii. It's Maskey's trifecta. So if you come visit me um, here, those of you that know me personally, you may go out in the kayak with me. It is a tandem. And I do hope if my finances improve to get two single kayaks, inflatable, so I can take them out and about. But if I get singles, I got the tandem and two singles, then we got flexibility. Four people at one time could be out in the kayaks if there's a total of four people here. So if you do visit me and you know me, you got a free place to stay. Um, we could go out in the kayak, we could swim in the pool, we could walk the neighborhood. And if you do all three in the same day, you can have say you've completed Maskey's trifecta. <laughs> so anyway, it's back to my kombucha. And I want to bring this to an end and maybe go watch a bit of Netflix tonight. So y'all stay safe. Tomorrow, we'll talk a little bit on financial stuff. Oh, maybe it's stocks. Maybe it's real estate. Maybe it's living below your means and being frugal. Maybe it's using credit cards to optimize your life. Or maybe it'll be something else. Maybe it'll be crypto or investing in oil or mineral rights or art or wine. So you'll find out tomorrow because I'll find out tomorrow. So all right, y'all stay safe. Keep smiling. Love life. And Maskey is signing out.